Is this the greatest teenage flop in the history of football? Every so often in soccer, you get a phenomenon from Pele to Maradona, Ronaldo to Messi. But as I said, they only come around ever so often. In between the Maradona and the Messi era, there was one kid who was hailed as the next big thing. Enter Freddie Adu. At just 14 years old, Adu secured a $1 million sponsorship deal with Nike, being compared to legends like Tiger Woods and LeBron James. Even Pele starred with him in commercials. At 14, he broke to DC United's first team and scored his first professional goal. He seemed destined for greatness. At 16, he trained with Manchester United under the watchful eye of Sir Alex Ferguson, arguably the greatest manager ever. He really was about to be huge. But alas, his career took a different turn. Freddie Adu didn't quite impress at Manchester United and ended up as a bit of a traveling footballer at mediocre clubs around Europe. He is now playing for a third division Swedish team. Definitely not the trajectory expected from the most prodigious talent of the 21st century. Adu claims that his downfall is because he was treated as a marketing tool from a very young age. He might have a case to be fair. Despite his career struggles, the story does have a happy ending. Adu used his earnings to financially help his mum, who had been working multiple jobs to support him ever since she emigrated from Ghana to the USA. So, is Freddie Adu the greatest teenage flop? Or is there someone with a bigger predicted future that flops? Let me know your thoughts in the comments below.